Hey guys, welcome to the vlog. So today we're gonna do something very different because as you can see, I have a new Electrolux Ref and this refrigerator has been serving us super well in the family. And you know what, by the way, before I get into what's inside, I wanna show you first what's outside. Amelia loves playing with this. What a professional! She can get her own water with this refrigerator. So in this household, I like emptying my ref before I do grocery because I don't want to buy stuff that I already have. I want to basically finish everything so there's no food wasted. So I'm going to show you my empty ref. Ta-da! Well, this for me is already empty. And here is where we put throw all of our fruits. She see there's already some fruits inside and sometimes we even store some chocolates in here. This is where we do all our cheese and stuff that are flat. Maybe meat or... Salami! Ham! Yeah, salami, ham, um, spam. <laughs> here is the ice maker up there. If it's water, we just do the sea. And then this is cube. That means cubed ice. So watch this. So this is crushed ice. There, the ice is crushed. Cool, right? And that's how you do the water trick with this Electrolux new um, refrigerator, which we got. Tough my job. <laughs> uh, I don't know how to vlog now because I feel like my daughter's better than me. <laughs> yeah. So anyway, um, so. As you can see, Olivia took over, explained everything on the top. So at the bottom, this is my favorite part, and this is my side. It's her favorite part because she likes the wines and all the Cokes. That's true. And so let me show you my favorite part. You know where all we keep the stuff that are cold? This one and this one were my favorite. Part. So this is okay. kind of stocked up, so we are not going to buy grocery or anything frozen because we have to finish this first. Um, you know, we have like gyoza here, which is mine and Ollie's favorite. Yeah, yeah. We love this. This is like it's a... It's kind of like a Nutella sandwich, but it's healthy. Nutella sandwich is I already... This is vegetables. <laughs> all vegetables are fine. Yeah. I didn't even know it has vegetables. That's why it's good. So now, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to the grocery. So I have a full grocery list of the items we need to buy. It's always good to make a list. Okay, let's go. So on to my grocery list. I usually get the items with the biggest containers, ditching the small tiny bottles and sachets. Also, talking about bulk, you can't have enough toilet paper. That's a lot of tissue <laughs> paper. I noticed also in supermarkets that if you buy in bulk or if you buy the biggest containers, they usually come out cheaper too. We are ditching the sachets and we are buying coffee with containers so we can actually reuse these containers later on. We actually use it to store rice or sometimes the food of Wookie. <laughs> By the way, let's not forget the items for the kids. Also, don't forget to bring your echo bags. Even if they have boxes or paper bags in the grocery, it's still better to bring your own and the bigger, the better. Then I head to the local palenque or markets for my weekly fruits and vegetables. I also have a chit chat with my suke who has known me ever since I was pregnant with Amelia. Hi, Ate. Hi, you want to leave? <laughs> <laughs> What I love about going to the local market or the palenque is that you get to choose the vegetables. It's super fresh, plus you also get to support local. So we are getting geta or coconut milk from the palenque and this is how they do it. They make it tayod and then they squeeze it until you get the juice of the coconut. So you can, you know, cook it with vegetables, make inataang um, gulay mamaya. My kids also asked me to get them mangoes and this 2 kilos can actually last them 2 days. Also, the Philippines has the best mangoes in the world. Okay, so finally done with grocery. You know when the kids are not with me, I can do grocery shopping in like 45 minutes. So when the kids are with me, it takes like 2 hours. We got bananas and we also got this chunk of ginger. There are onions. <laughs> 
I'm gonna cry when I see this. This is gulai. Okay. Gulai is Tagalog for vegetables. Amia, look. Look what I got you. What's this? Nah. Kids, what's this? What is this? This is yes. called cigarillas. Amelia can literally finish all of this in two days. Everything. This is sinigang. Uh, this big one. We got big Gatorade also. What's that? Mega. Oh my god. Toothpaste. Toothpaste. Yeah. Have Their favorite. What's that? Nutella. What's that? We're gonna put everything inside the wrap. Okay. So this refrigerator is basically theirs because all of the items here belongs to them. Usually what happens is if they're hungry, they want merienda, they just open the refrigerator and they just get whatever they want. So everything has to be accessible. You can do it. Another one. Okay, put the bread inside the rip. Yeah, I can eat it. Hey. <laughs> so this is where we put our eggs and we buy organic eggs from the market. Okay, and this is medicine of the kids. Um, I put it there so they won't reach it and it's safe. Just like the eggs. As you can see, we have a lot of space because we cook a lot and we have a lot of leftover food. We reuse the containers that they give us for takeout usually. So this is our um, tira. We had this last night so we're gonna reheat this later and have it for dinner. Mostly um, this layer here is all for leftover food so this is our leftover food. This is the chocolates. We'll store them here. Okay, so there you go. That's my refrigerator, my Electrolux refrigerator. And this is my favorite appliance here in this kitchen. And I hope you enjoy this vlog. And I know I talked about meal plans earlier. If you guys want to go check it out, I'll put it all down below at the description. So, bye!